resolving conflicts. Step number seven, bless. First Peter chapter three, verses eight and nine. Finally, all of you be of one mind, having compassion for one another. Love as brothers, be tender-hearted, be courteous, not returning evil for evil or reviling for reviling, but on the contrary, blessing, knowing that you were called to this, that you may inherit a blessing. The final step that we want to present here as we talk about resolving conflicts and human interactions is that of blessing or releasing blessing. As Peter tells us here, you know, we walk in love, we have compassion, and we do not return evil for evil, but instead we return blessing. So even when people have harmed us or hurt us, our response is blessing. We release blessing. We speak words of blessing. We bless the other person. We affirm them. We thank them. We are kind to them. We are gracious to them. We recognize the good they have done. We recognize whatever uh, positive things we can. We release blessing and we speak the goodness and the mercies and the blessings of God over their lives. And Peter says, that's what we've been called to do. This is our calling, that when people do evil to us, we release the blessing of God over them. And he says, when we do that, we ourselves inherit a blessing. We ourselves receive the blessing of God on our lives as we release a blessing to others, even if they have done evil to us. So this it brings a closure to that relationship that that is being restored that as we resolve conflict we release blessing over that person so just quickly to review step number one we prepare our heart before god step number two we receive love and empowering uh, we receive god's empowering to love and forgive step three we receive god's wisdom to know what issues we have to address step four we lovingly discuss the matter um, uh, uh, and we address issues uh, that need to be addressed. Uh, step five, we make peace. Step number six, we forgive. Step number seven, we release blessing. We bless. Let's pray. Oh Lord God, we ask that you'll enable us, even when there are conflicts, to see relationships restored. That we may walk with peace towards people. That as much as possible, as much as lies within our power, that we will walk in peace. We'll follow peace with all people. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.